everybody, it's Esther. And Danielle. And welcome to day seven of the 31 days of Halloween. Can you believe we're already up to day seven, Danielle? <laughs> I keep looking this way to look past the camera at her. <laughs> For those of you who do, don't know, Danielle is five foot three. So when she's sitting behind the camera, the camera is completely blocking her face. <laughs> oh. She Unless inherited they sit her height. They yeah. don't want to. She inherited her height from her dad's side of the family. Uh, my husband's mother is like five feet tall. She is, she's adorable. I love her. All right, it's been a crazy busy day here in our household. Crazy busy. Danielle had a lot of school to do today because she's taking college classes. So we didn't get uh, as much done today as we would have liked. <laughs> so what we're going to do today is show you the ornaments we made last year. Which, because I wasn't making like YouTube videos and talking about everything we do, uh, I don't think anybody saw. So let's let's show some of the things we did. Okay, one of the first things we made was this sign. Okay, we bought it at Dollar Tree. It had a a jute type uh, cording on it, but it it just didn't look good, so we took it off and replaced it with this. Ribbon it says trick or treat. Uh, the ribbon I think came from Michaels. And it was just black and white. We added a few embellishments and some color. I think for this year we might add a few more things and gussy it up a little bit more. What do you think, Danielle? Yeah. Alright, so we'll put that in our to do's. We had a few store bought things that we used. These were from Dollar Tree Glow in the Dark Mice and scorpions and those will probably find their way around our display somewhere let's see what else oh we had these this garland of skeletons it's backwards oh it was a little head spun <laughs> around <laughs> he's the exorcist just need some pea soup I know you don't get that reference do you know? <laughs> Uh, oh, and spider rings. Spider rings are great because if you leave the ring part on, then it can catch in the stuff. But you can also snip that off and glue these straight onto projects. So always we've got some of these spider rings. Now, was that in everything I had around me? I think so. Okay, on to the ornaments. All right, we made this last year, this Happy Halloween sign. With glitter paper. Yeah, with glitter paper. And we used several uh, thicknesses of cardstock to make several it a little sturdier. Several layers, you mean? Several layers. Well, to make it thicker. Yeah. And we hung that at the top of the tree. We made these ghosts. Every ornament you see, except for the tree topper, we actually made five of. So there's five ghosts, five of each one. The ghost is kind of plain. Last year we went for cute. This year I think we might go for a little more spooky. There's no little kids here. Will you get spooked by a spooky ghost, Danielle? No. Alright. The next ornament we made last year was the spider witch. And all these images are from Cricut Design Space. Isn't that cute? Okay, the next one is this jack-o'-lantern. Can you tell we're big fans of sparkle? <laughs> what really is curious to me is that we used sparkle for the spider witches, sparkle for the pumpkin, sparkle for the Halloween sign, and sparkle for the little monster we're going to show here in a second. And this poor ghost... It's not sparkly. No sparkle. <laughs> Maybe we should wink of Stella in. Wink of Stella. Oh, I love Wink, Wink of, of Stella. Wink of what I say. Don't you want to know who Stella is? <laughs> okay, the last ornament we made last year was the mo three-eyed monster. <laughs> That's Danielle's hand, you see. And then we have ones with blue antenna or horns or whatever. Did we make them different? No, we just made this one with black and then the rest with blue. Oh, yeah. 
Why'd we do that? I don't know. Was that glitter we added after? Yeah. Cause the, oh. They were right before. Oh, that's right. I totally forgot. Your memory's better, Danielle, because you're 20. Mm -hmm. And I'm not 20. <laughs> <laughs> All right, everybody. In the description box below, offer us some suggestions. Hey, we did get a suggestion to make a... What was that? A haunted birdhouse? One of my friends suggested that. What do you think, Dino? Yeah, that's cool. Yeah. And uh, so I heard they were at Dollar Tree. We're going to have to go make a Dollar Tree run. Want to yep. do that tomorrow? i got to go to the post office and mail some packages. Yep. Gareth, something's headed your way. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Everybody, thank you so much for watching our series. I can't believe we're at day seven already. And yes, I have more Halloween tricks in my mind to do. <laughs> All right, as always, remember, check the description box below for where to find us and our address. I almost said home address. <laughs> the P.O. box. Uh, and what else? Oh, yeah. We love you guys. You're awesome. And thanks for watching. We will see you in a video tomorrow. Bye. Bye.